Hey what's up guys, it is TBM TCG and we are back again with Force of Will. Now this is our second unboxing. The first one is a darkness deck with the booster set that you get when you first start the game with one of those ones, well one of the newer ones shall I say. And this is one of the older sets. Uh, it is the fixed card set Vingolf. Basically I think this came out just before the new booster boxes came out with the new um, J rulers but this is not too bad because it actually has five J rulers in it plus the fixed decks that go actually in it as well plus a little surprise as well because you also get like a special pack but what I've done I've already cracked open the uh, plastic so we can slide it off but we're gonna look at the artwork first so there you go so you got force of will you got all the different J rulers um, pretty sure oh no I think there's one missing maybe one, two, three, four. Yeah, I think there's five of them. I'm pretty sure there is. Uh, but yeah, they're all fixed sets, so it is quite nice. Please, I do apologise for the glare on the um, on the light, but this uh, this light does seem to give me quite good sort of um, focus for my camera as well. But yeah, so this is the front of it. A lot of artwork onto it. Then you've got a side, so it gets like the f it tells you about the fixed set, the Vingol. It gives you all the different other sets as well that you get with it. Um, on the side, it tells you what you got. So it, the one box contains 20, 225 cards, 95 different kinds of cards. And it says the same thing again that it says on the bottom. And the same thing again that it says on the side. So yeah, this is the English version. But for me, this only cost me £35 at my um, local little shop. But it's really good there. Um, what I will do, probably do, is I might ha attach it in the link below, but so you can check out the Facebook. But it's really good. It there's a lot of uh, great things in there. It's like a landscape, to be honest. You sort of go in there, and that is it. But anyways, we're gonna get on to the uh, cracking on the, of the box. So I've already done that. Lid goes there, and you are greeted with bonus cards and your 5J rulers with the fixed packs. So we're going to go with, um, I'm always a top left person, so we'll go top left. Actually, you know what? No, 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 no. We'll take these out. We'll look at the boring stuff first. So, got your box. And these are the things that you get. So it is a uh, forcible manual. Already had one of these when it comes to the uh, unboxing of the um, of uh, the booster box, I'm pretty sure this is a playmat. Yeah, it is. It's an actual playmat. Fair enough. Quite a nice little playmat as well. Oh, got a little map and all that. East European. Uh, by that we are we live at Dokum apparently. By the looks of it, anyway. But yeah. Quite nice, but yeah, it's got your main deck, graveyard. It even tells you how it goes. You draw phase, your recovery phase, your main phase into your battle phase, and your end phase. Standby area, your ruler, magic stones area, and your magic stones deck. So that is actually quite nice for someone that is starting off. I am still technically starting off at the time being, only due to the fact that I'm still trying to figure out what kind of deck I want to use. But there's many things, many, 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 many things that are out there at this moment in time but it's just a matter of what I actually want to do so we'll put that aside and this is, oh, got another one ok, got two of them they would show you that and then this is a how to win apparently it's that bloody easy, you just give them a how to win deck and that is it but, go from there that is all that and so Five decks, five different decks. So you got yourself a water, light, fire, uh, grass or nature, however you want to say it, and darkness. I am a darkness deck, so I will be looking into that, so I might save that till last. So we'll start at the top of the water. Put that aside. And yep, well, we'll get this out of the pack first. I do have as well a bunch of sleeves, fairly nice things. But I am trying to still get used to opening packs because every pack seems to be different. But 
there you go, it might be a resealable bag as well. Depending on how nicely you treat the uh, the pack. Oh, saying that, I've got it stuck. Can't be doing that. Right, okay. So, what we'll do, we'll start off with our ruler. Which is, hopefully it'll focus in, yep. There you go. I might do just take the light up a little bit. Sorry about that. Ah, much better. Yep. Alicia Melchior. That is the ruler that you get. Gives you a little bit of a judgment. You may pay one less to play this ability for each Squad 7 Resonator you control. So not too bad. Quite good. But we we're looking at the um, other side, which is really cool. So when this card enters your field, return target Resonator to its own hand. When this card enters your field you may add an additional J resonator from your hand to this card and then yeah so 800 800 not too bad so we'll put that to the side and we'll go through every single deck yeah so you got Alicia's Lance you got the Bri I'm guessing that is yeah Bridgite Rosie Stark 700 700 squad 7 Cordelia de Rand Grizz, I'm guessing that's how it is, a 0600. Eleanor Varrett, not too bad. Another 900, 900. Fadio Lanzart. See, all, all really good little cards. Izara Gunther, or Gunther, how do you want to pronounce it? 200, 200. And a Crease. Um, Chesney, I'm guessing that's the name. It's another 300, 300. Largo Potter. Quite cool. Um, I don't know how to pronounce that. Moritz von Borg. Sounds very sinister, to be honest. Momentary Respite. Not too bad. You can pause this at any point if you want to do... Um, Look at what the abilities do, but I will, I will show every everyone. Sniping from the blind spot. And we got the Carefree Three. Draw three cards. Nice little card that is. Welkin Gunner again. Saka. Another squad seven. Oh, and we have. Edelweiss or Edelweiss, you may pay two less to play Judgment Abilities. Banish this card, squad seven, you control game 400 400 until the end of turn. Play this ability only if you control a J Ruler. And there's all your stones that you get, so you get your dark stones, light, water, a fair few of them. And then we've got more items again. And it looks like we're going through the whole lot again. Yep. So you get two of each, pretty much. But artwork's really good. But is there any difference? No, there's no difference. I thought there would have been like a sh like shiny ones or whatever. No, I don't know why they separate them in that case. Then, but there we go. That is pack one. Pack one ain't too bad. So I'm not used to this sort of art style as well. Cause it is slightly different. But yeah, not too bad. Quite like that. So, second one, we've got Alicia Gunter. I'm guessing that's his sister. I'm only going by uh, by the by the surnames. Usually, it's a fair shout when it comes to anime sort of stuff. If there's two Gunters, no doubt they are going to be somewhat siblings. But she seems like quite a cool. So she, so she's the J ruler. So the other side is going to look quite timid. Yeah, they're yeah, not too bad in the end. So uh, there's the ruler side, Alicia Melcott, and that is the J ruler side. Not too bad. A four hundred one thousand. When this card enters your field, recover all squad seven re resonators you control. Squad resonators you control gain 200 200. So it's very much of like a, a buffing sort of deck. 
Yep, yeah, so we've got Clementia Forster. Edie Nelson. Ocean Flower. First Aid. What's that? So you gain 200 life at each match. Zone. Wow, okay. That could be a good like, late game. Flakjack here. Print all damage I've dealt to an added J resonator. So I say Homer. Homer Perrin. When he's cut into the field, gain 500 life. Wow, this is very much of a buff your life sort of thing. Irene Ellett. Is that Ian? Yeah, Ian Walker. Not too bad. Lynn. Very much of an army related um, fixed deck, these are. Marina Wolfstan. Yep. Martha Leponen. Pregnant. It's always good. Susie Evans. I like how they got English names as well. Symbol of Peace. Welva Glen and a rag knight. And then you got yourself Gusty Skies, Magic Stone of Heat Ray, Light Magic, Light Magic, and you got it all again. So same decks all again. So it ain't too bad. I like how it gives you fixed decks. Because at least then you can actually just run with these. Yep, keep Jay all up front. But we'll open up the pack at the end, the um, the free bonus cards, because you might actually get something solid, which would be quite nice, to be honest. Yep, onto the uh, fire. Yeah, onto the old fire pack. There you go. So that is Rila Marcellus, so I'm guessing that's right. So judgment, you would pay one less to, to play this ability for each nameless resonate you control. So that is the uh, ruler side. And that is your J ruler. As long as you control Kurt Iving, this gains this card gains swiftness. When this card enters the field, it deals a thousand damage to a target resonate. Wow. So that could really cock someone up. But I like how there's actually loads of decks because that means I've pretty much covered all the different fields so I can actually play with whatever I want. But yeah, so there she is. I'll put her to the side. All right, so we've got ourselves. Alphonse, Al Claire, Amy Apple, nameless. Oh wow, this card cannot be attacked. Got bombardment. Carissa Kortzen, yeah, Kortzen. Clarissa Callaghan. Those are really cool names, actually. Quite English names as well. Courageous Stand. Ooh. Frederica Lips. Oh. Gooserge, I'm guessing the name is Gooserge. Quite cool. Imka. Look at the size of that gun that she's got. Kurt Iving. So that is the card, Kurt Iving. So yeah, swiftness is first strike. Whenever a resonator that was dealt damage by this card, this turn is put into a graveyard. This card deals five damage to your opponent. Wow, he is strong. Large explosion. Layla Perrin. Margaret Ravelli. Raiders Lance. And the Nameless Tank. On top of this, you got more jewel stones. On top of that, fire, 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 fire. What you gonna get? And then it's just a repeat again of all the cards that I've already shown you. Right. Right, put her at the front. Next 
next up we'll go for the grass or nature, however you want to pronounce it, or however you want to say it. LA's so it's five judgment to actually um, cast her into a J ruler stance wow okay so whenever this card attacks recover all magic stones you control that is stupid so you could if I'm right you could attack and then get all your things back and then do some more damage with spells yep we'll put her to silence as per so we got ourselves Alexis Hilden, Alexis Lance, Anaset Nelson, Avan Hardins, Bulletproof Barrier, Cosette, oh my god, I can't even say that, Cosette Colehearth. Wow. These must be the, the, uh, the posh kids at school. Destructive Assault, Juliana Evanhart, Lavinia Lane, Megaria, Marion Siege, oh no, Sage Barn, Power of Unity, Renee Randall. I wouldn't actually think these people are actually fighters. Uh, Zeri. She's like quite a, a posh child. Class G tank. Nice. And then you've got your stones again. Black Silence. Deep Wood. Magic Stone, Magic Stone, Magic Stone, Magic Stone. And a repeat. So, grab all them. Plonk her there. And the final one, and the one that I'm most excited about, due to the fact that I have darkness, but looking at the fire one and the grass one, or nature, however you want to pronounce it, or however you want to say it, because I'm sort of in like the magic they go over in sort of state of mind, but I'm also in this sort of state of mind. So it's sort of a tomato tomato. Right. Okay, so. Savaria Blez is right here. So she's got her judgment by the looks of it. Yep, yeah, you pay three less to play this ability if you control Maximilian. So that's a ruler side, and a J ruler side is right here. When this card enters the field, up to two resonators to gain a minus 300, minus 300 for each dry stern you control. So I'll pop her there. And there we go. So we've got Audrey Gassinari, a Baldwin, oh my god, I can't even that. Baldwin Gassinari, Berthold Gregor, uh, we've got Dahal, Dirk Gassinari, Gilbert Gassinari. Must be some sort of a family. And then we got Hammer of the Valkyr. Destroy target J Resonator. Lydia Axe. Ah, oh, Maximilian. Right, a little posh toff. Ray Diego. Is that Rans Raj Rajnaid Gas. Tiger Resonator gains minus 500. Schemes of the Empire. So far as Lance. You got Zig. Zig looks quite cool. As long as you control Dahu. This card gains 400. So it's pretty much you battle off each other. And you got the Imperial Tank. And then you got the Heaven's Rift. And then you got the Jewel Stones. Which are quite cool. And then back to start. So overall, this little box here, which is cheap, £35 to the English, uh, looking about $50 I'd say, 
about fifty dollars to the Americans. Might be wrong, but I'm probably right. But yeah, not too bad for five decks that are already preloaded. And to top it off, Force of Will are thrown in a uh, bonus cards. So quite heavy. I guess it is one pack. So sorry for doing this behind camera. Oh wow. Okay. So the glue that they use ain't the easiest. Aha. Right. Cool. Ooh. Shiny. Savaria's Lance. Oh, they're all shiny. Magaria. Izara Gunther. Kurt Ivy. Jaime Perron. Zeke. Frederica Lips. Carefree Free. Renee Randall. And you got a right tonight. So you got all these cards are actually in the deck, but they're obviously hot like your your shiny ones, which are quite nice. I like that little touch. Well done to the creators of um, Force of Will. Yeah, it's done quite well. And it's cheap as well. But anyways, guys, if you did like this episode of um, open up more TCG related things, and this time it has been Force of Will. But if you did like this, uh, hit that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, share some love for my first channel, which is all game related, so if you love the games, go check it out, go check it out right now, I'm looking at you, I'm talking to you. But anyways guys, this is TBM TCG signing out. This deck, I'm guessing it is all like your monsters and cryptids and whatnot, and your J-Ruler, if that is your J-Ruler, everyone's got a J-Ruler. And these must be your stone and your earth. So we'll go this one first. Oh, oh hang on. I've got